there Star Wars Collectors and welcome to another Bosk's Bounty video and in this video we're going to be doing a Star Wars unboxing. That's right, we're going to be unboxing this very box here which I've been waiting for quite a while to arrive and it is finally here, thank the Lord, and you guys are going to love what is inside, believe me. So, without further ado, let's get the box open and if you do happen to enjoy the video, don't forget to drop a like down below and I thank everyone for supporting the channel hitting 15,000 subscribers is awesome so thank you to everyone that does subscribe and if you don't subscribe make sure you do hit that subscribe button and then we can see what's in this box so it has come from the states um let's be careful with this box cutter stanley all right. So let's move the box over here and then we can get everything out into this little space here. So first up, oh, lovely. We have Grief Karga VC185 on the Mandalorian card. Very nice indeed. Just try and get rid of that glare for you. Then we have Princess Leia Bespin Escape, VC187. Now, of course, I will be doing reviews on all of these figures in the coming days, so be sure to check those out. Next up, we have The Child, VC184, looking pretty cool. Next up, we have Zutton or Zuton, however you want to pronounce that. He's VC 189. Awesome wave, this one. And of course, the wave wouldn't be complete without the Return of the Jedi, Boba Fett, and by the time you're watching this video, you've probably and hopefully already watched my review of this figure because I'll be putting that video up first. VC186. Just look how good he looks. I cannot wait to get this guy out of the package and review him. Um, obviously, there's a lot of history around this card back, kind of, or recent history. When they first announced the card back, it had an orange name pill and the orange block behind the character or behind the figure, rather. And it was like a more zoomed in image and he didn't have his legs or anything. And I, amongst a lot of other people, wanted it looking like the original card back. This is how it looked back in 1983 with the yellow um, and the sort of airbrushed legs. So they listened to the fans and they did a running change. But apparently, and we don't know 100% for sure, but apparently a few of the orange cards got out of the factory and we don't know where they're going to land, but... I've got a yellow one, hopefully I do have a few other pre-orders, uh, other retailers and stuff like that. So hopefully, you know, the orange one will turn up into my possession, which would be pretty awesome. But you never know what's going to happen. But um, yeah, that's the recent history behind this. There's going to be two versions of this Boba Fett, with the orange one probably being the rarer of the two, or almost certainly, because, you know, this yellow one's going to be everywhere. And I would imagine that Hasbro are going to be making you know thousands and thousands of this figure um it's not a perfect figure which you will see in my review um there is one slight little thing which is a, a bit annoying about it and we will come to that in the review but um it's almost a perfect three and three quarter inch action figure and they have done an amazing job and we'll we'll, we'll see more in the review so there you go then guys that is the the wave um, I don't even know what wave number it is these days. It could be 31 or something, or some people count from the beginning of the year. Some people count from when the vintage collection came back. If you're going all the way back, I think it could be uh, wave 31, I think. Uh, but I'm not 100% sure about that. But um, some website somewhere will have the correct numbering. Uh, but there you go. So yeah, we've got Zuton, Grief Karga, Princess Leia, The Child, and Boba Fett makes for an awesome wave of figures and as i said i just cannot wait to review them all and as i mentioned if you're watching this video now 
hopefully you've already seen my review of the best one of the wave, the Boba Fett. So let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Have you picked up these figures yet? Have you got them on pre-order? Let me know in the comments below. And thank you very much for watching. And we shall see you on the next one.